so you know, Nathan Drake is no longer in the picture. You don't have to worry about it. I had my concerns. Why do you accept my offer? I'm not one to look at your course in the market, especially with everyone wanting to see me fall. I hear that. But on the plus side... Oh, there's a plus side? Oh, people have low expectations. It's much easier to take them by surprise. As far as I'm concerned, this business is tough enough on your own. You have to take any advantage you can. You always worked alone? Mostly. How old were you when you started? Young. Learned quickly enough I needed to let people think they were getting their way. And then I could get the upper hand. Too subtle for me. I always preferred the direct approach. Yeah, whatever works, I say. Sov's men might be around. Look up there. Parashrama's bow. Spotted this on the tower, too. So, Parashrama... Parashurama. Parashurama. Right. Who was he again? Okay. Six avatar of the god Vishnu. A fearsome warrior. Trained in the martial arts by Shiva himself, but only after conquering the whole world to convince him of his worthiness. <laughs> and I thought I had it bad. It should do the trick. There. Okay. to that shithole, finally. I was starting to think the boss was all talk. I'd watch your mother. Sorry. Soon it won't matter. Once we have the task, the people will follow like sheep. Yeah, even the mighty Indian army will tremble. I can't wait. That's it. We're clear. Probably alluded to the others. <laughs> Can't be helped. Hey, on the mountain! Here come the others! You boys really don't want me shooting from down here. <laughs> no! <it's... laughs> okay. We're all clear. Won't be the last of them. 
There is a big truck parked out front. We'll keep our eyes open. <clears throat> We'd better. We'd walk right off a cliff. You do have a sense of humor. <sighs> Would have preferred a head start over a soft. Not much we can do. Besides, doesn't matter who starts, only who finishes. Fair point. Think a source men know what they're looking for? Not from what I can tell. Good. Hope you'd have one advantage at least. See that? Looks like another faucet. Let's find a way up. <laughs> Follow me! How are you, so What? Safety's off. Move out. Find them. Another man down. Come out, asshole! Hmm? We have something, maybe. Check it out. Move. I got it. Nothing over there? It's gone. Whatever it was.
Start secure. Well done. And you said I was like a bull in a china shop. I never said that. No, but you thought it. Got me there. Let's press on. Just what I was going to say. Some kind of mechanism. Here we go. Perfect. That should do it. find your way over here. Oh, definitely. Figured you'd want to take the easy way over. Just don't get started without me. Sure. Wouldn't dream of it. Okay, guess this isn't the way in. Oh, there you are. Having fun. Just like the monkey bars in primary school. I'd say this looks safer than the playground at my school. I'm impressed. You're impressed. I'm tired. Let's get this done. All right. I'm guessing it'll be a bow this time. Good guess. Sharama. Right. Let's turn the water on. Well, well. What's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. <laughs> Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh. Oh. I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. It's two out of three now. Also, I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. It's 
So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's pretty funny. Last stop, the fort embedded in that mountain. That'll be the one with the axe. At least your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. Ah, oh, this is open now. Huh? <laughs> 